just right in the distance but at least there is the view of the second one so that's three Birmingham's this morning now just to find the fourth I'm not sure which Birmingham it is turn this way that's Mfumo by the looks of things looks like there's a big cut under his eye there so it looks like Mfumo there so I don't know who the other one is maybe Tinyo or Nena that is also with him but he's just dropping down towards some water which he'll drink there and then hopefully from there he's going to come up and out back towards this other male that's sleeping on the right hand side here so he's moving generally towards where that other male is so hopefully we will be able to find them it's at least a brief 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 glimpse of a third Birmingham boy and I'm hoping beyond all hope that they decide to move in this direction I also saw the tracks for the buffalo they went and drank here and then they obviously got pushed by the lions from here all the way southwards to where quarantine is so I don't know where that buffalo herd ended up in the end they must be still running by now they must have had a very tough time of it last night because not only did they have the Nkuma pride but there was also three Birmingham boys hanging around which is not a good place to be if you're a buffalo between all of that and as you can see one of them did meet a sticky end I'm afraid but I don't know what's wrong with our lions why they keep disappearing on us they keep lying and going into areas where it's difficult to actually see them Let's, we'll have to just be patient, I suppose, and, and, and hope that one of them comes out a little bit more. Well, there we go. There's the, another buffalo kill with the third, fourth Birmingham. So there we go. All four Birmingham boys. We've had them on camera this morning, which I don't know when the last time that happened obviously we can't ID who's who's at this stage you can see he's hot and bothered but he's protecting his kill there was actually a side striped jackal that tried to run in there and he came charging out and chased the jackal away I don't know where the jackals run now but there is a side striped jackal hanging around so this must be the original kill from the Nkuhumas I can see the tracks from lions chasing the buffalo in this area so I think they originally killed us and the Birmingham's then came in and pushed the Nkuhumas off and that's why We've seen a situation where the Inkumas maybe went after another one, or the Birmingham himself followed the rest of the buffalo and brought down that other one that we see closer towards the camp. But isn't this exciting to have all of the Birmingham boys around? Hopefully, these three are going to actually come out at some point, and we're going to be able to see them nicely and see all three of them this side as well as in Suko on the other side. So it would be really nice to have all four around. But that buffalo is almost finished in comparison to what we see from the buffalo around quarantine. There's still so much there, and I would imagine once these guys are finished tonight, they're going to move their way to the one on quarantine and wouldn't it be great if we could have all four Birmingham's together on a buffalo kill on quarantine that would be a first for many many moons in fact I can't even remember the last time I saw all four of the Birmingham's together it's it's been a very long time since we've seen that and you can see how he's dragging it deeper into the shade at the moment so he's trying to get it under some trees and, and they do this to try and avoid getting vultures around here which attracts unwanted attention so that's why they like to drag things into these thickets Difficult to make out who it is at the moment. I don't know if you guys at home can see a little bit better and you can work out who he is. Um, difficult, like I say, we know that Mfumo was the one that went down to drink, so hopefully he's going to come back. And then it's either Tinyo or Nsuku that's here. I can't see nicely though as he's dragging. There's a lot of glare on the screen at the moment. Maritza, you say, is this Juma or Mara? And you say, lol, at the end. Well, I know, it's crazy, isn't it, that we've all of a sudden got lions coming out of our ears, from no lions to lions everywhere. It's incredible that we get to see them. Are you going to come down towards us? So that looks like, who's, who have we got there? Is it maybe Mfumo? You see how he's covering the blood trail there? So they do this just to stop it being smelling and things like hyenas coming into this area. Come on, come a little bit closer so I can see who you are properly. Oof, he looks like he's coming towards us. I don't know, Alice, maybe somebody might have ID'd him. I'm battling to see in this light. It's really very harsh on the camera screen, I mean on the monitor that I've got. I'm going to try look through my binoculars and just see who exactly we've got here. Is he lying down now or is he moving? He's right behind a bush, so it's very difficult. No, don't lie down there. Come out a little bit. Yeah, it looks like he might just sniff around. I wonder if he's picking up the scent of the lionesses in that area. 
But at least he's come out a little bit for us so we can actually get a nice view. There we go. Now he's looking at us. He's right over the stomach content of that buffalo. Now that I look through the binoculars, I can see all the stomach content that he's sniffing around. You see he's going to cover that up, try and scrape some sand. He's not doing it very well. It's a bit half-hearted at this stage. Come on, come out for us. That's better. Now you're getting proper dust on it. Come this way. Come on. And he's now urinating over the buffalo. <laughs> Stomach content. As if it's not bad enough to eat them. Now that you've got to urinate over their scent as well. Just to make sure that everybody knows that this is their buffalo. Adele, you think it's Tinyo? I might agree with you, Adele. It's difficult. I can't see his face nicely. You can see now he's just presenting his backside. And look at how round his tummy is in comparison to those females. That's why I was saying that... When males eat, or when lions eat buffalo, they generally get massive round tummies. So his tummy is very big, but I'm just waiting for him to look in my direction one more time, because I keep missing him with the binoculars. No, he's going to move off the wrong way now. Still busy trying to cover the scent of what's going on. But how amazing is this? Four different male lines in a drive. So cool to see. And on two buffalo kills. It just goes to show you, as soon as buffalo arrive in this area, these guys are on top of it very quickly. Now, let's quickly jump across to Byron, who's got himself a bird, and to keep up his bird list before they disappear.